In this video, I am going to discuss about uh, find a shortest and a longest word in a sentence. Suppose if I enter any sentence like hello, how are you? So the shortest word is you length 1 and the longest word hello length 5. Next, I am going to discuss about the drawing method of this program. So, if you debug the code, then first control comes to main method. Here, after that, we will go inside. So, console class with right line method is there. So, whatever inside or double code that will display into the output screen. 
Nick, I have taken a string str variable. Uh, so add here console dot line. So I'm going to into hi are uh, you uh, so at your that will whatever I'm going to enter so that will go to str so next one str equal to str plus a uh, blank space so add here a uh, blank space and uh, next line uh, int length uh, so I've taken a uh, length uh, integer type variable so at your str dot uh, length so that will count the length of str so this is a 2 1 blank space 3 4 5 6 and 1 more 7 so total length of uh, str 7 that will go to lm length next uh, i have taken uh, a string type variable k max mean okay max and name so all initialize with uh, nothing and uh, next variable is char ch and on uh, next to uh, integer type variable p and max1 So I have max one initialize with uh, zero, and on uh, next to integer uh, variable mean one. So I have max one initialize with zero and about mean one or uh, length value go to mean one. So length value is uh, seven that will go to mean one. Now next uh, control comes to uh, for loop so I have int uh, integer i variable is there so that is start from 0 or uh, check the condition 0 less than uh, length length value is now 7 0 less than 7 condition to then that will go inside so you check to str of i so str of, G, str of 0 position h is there So ch become h and add here that will go term if ch not equal to blank. So ch value is now h. So that's true, then that will go inside k equal to k plus ch. So k value is so uh, uh, blank is there. So blank plus uh, ch now k become h. So CH value is H. CH value is H. So blank plus H. No H. So here after if the if condition is true, then that will not go to the else part. Again, that will go and increase the value of I. So I 0 to 1. Now check the condition 1 less than 7. That's true. Then that will go inside CH equal to STR of 1 position. So 1 position is I is there. Now that will go uh, inside if CS value is now i, i not equal to blank, so condition is true, then that will go inside k equal to k plus ch. k value is now uh, h, h plus or uh, ch. So CS value is now i, so uh, k become hi. CS value is now i. Now again that will back and increase the value of i. So i become 0, uh, 1 to 2. Check the condition 2 less than 7, that's true, then that will go inside. Uh, CH equal to str of i. So str of 2 position blank space is there. Now that will go inside if 
uh, CH value is now blank, not equal to blank, so that's not true, then that will go to else part. So at here P equal to K dot length. So that will count the length of K. So K length is 2. That will store into P. So P will come to and now next to that will check the condition P less than mean 1. So 2 less than mean 1. So mean 1 value is now 7. So 2 less than or 7 condition true then that will go inside of positive condition so at your p value go to mean 1 p value is now 2 2 value go to mean 1 so mean 1 become 2 and now next uh, k value go to mean k value is now hi hi go to mean Now uh, that will go out from if uh, first if condition. Now that will control comes to this point if uh, p greater than max one. P value is now uh, two two greater than max one. So two greater than zero. So that's true. Uh, so here after that will go inside and check the uh, here check the condition condition true. Then that will go inside. P value go to max one. P value is now or two that will go to max one. So max 1 become 2 and k value go to max. k value is now hi so that will go to max. hi that will go to max. So max become hi. Now from here that will out from if and uh, k again uh, initialize with nothing. So from here, that will out from else part and again that will go and increase the value of i. So i become uh, 2 to 3. Check the condition 3 less than or uh, 7 that's true. Then that will go inside search equals to st of 3 position. 3 position is y is there. So y or uh, ch become y. CH uh, become Y and now check the condition Y not equal to blank so that's true then that will go inside K equal to K plus CH so K value is now uh, nothing so nothing plus uh, blank is blank plus uh, uh, CH so now K become a uh, CH value is now Y Y so K become Y Or k become y again that will go and increase the value of i so i become 4 this time check the condition 4 less than uh, 7 that's true then that will go inside ch equal to st or 4 position 4 position is o is there so check the condition o not equal to blank then that's truth k equal to k plus ch so k value is now y y plus ch so k become y o again that will increase the value of uh, i i become 5 Check the condition 5 less than 7, that's true, then that will go inside series equal to str of 5, 5 position or 5 position u is there, so u not equal to blank, that's true, k equal, and then that will go inside k equal to k plus ch, so k value is yo plus u, total become y o u, again that will go and increase the value of i, so i become uh, 5 to 6, So I tell uh, check the condition 6 less than uh, 7 so that's true then that will go inside ch equal to uh, str of i so 6 position is uh, blank space is there so blank space not equal to blank space so that's not true then that will go to the else part so I tell p equal to k dot length so length of k 3 so peak become 3. Uh, P become uh, 3. Now that will check the condition P less than mean. So P value is now 3. 3 less than uh, mean 1. Mean 1 is uh, 
2 so 3 less than or 2 so that's not true then that will not go to the this part again that will go to another if for condition check or p greater than max 1 p value is now or 3 max 1 value is now or max so 1 is or 2 so p value is 3 3 greater than or 2 then condition is true then that will go inside after p value go to max 1 p value is now 3 that will go to max 1 so max 1 become 3 and uh, next to uh, k value go to max k value is now or uh, max so k value y o u that will go to max so max become y o u uh, so I know, this part has been done now k again uh, become the thing and that will go out of else part again that will go and increase the value of i so i become 7 check the condition 7 or less than 7 condition is for so that will out from uh, for loop now control comes to this point so at here or uh, that will or uh, display shortest word or uh, mean so mean is hi and hi length of word uh, mean 1 so mean 1 value is not 2 so that will display again console or try longest word max max is y or u is the and or uh, length of the word max 1 or uh, max 1 or uh, that is 3 and after displaying all control comes to this there console dot read line method so that will take one input from the keyword and output output that terminate the output screen so i hope guys you understand the logic or dry read method of this program so now uh, in this session it's over so thanks for watching i'll see you in next video thank you again